Andre, we're so happy to have you here with us in Zelenograd. Tell us what brings you here today. Hello, Alexander. I always visit Zelenograd with great interest. It's always very interesting here for me. What brings us here? Testing the A90S motors installed on the electric sled and quad runners this summer. We have drawn a lot of interest from not only major investors interested in this technology, but also the administration of some cities, Kaluga and Obninsk. The purpose of our visit today is gaining a better understanding of implementing the combined winding technology in the concept of smart city. Obninsk signed the concept of smart city this spring and one of the key principles of this concept is saving electrical energy. Today I have a meeting with Dmitry Duinov and I have gained a much better understanding of the area where we can save energy in the most efficient way by using our motors. I don't know, maybe it sounds a bit hectic, but it's something like that. Andre, tell us please, you have some agreements with the administration as far as I understand, or there are no agreements? There are some, right. I mean the administration facilitates in every possible way the implementation of the technology for reducing energy consumption in our region. Does it mean that the administration wants to place an order for our motors? It's not unlikely. One of the topics of our today's discussion was the meeting of the administration and Savalmash top management. Thank you for the information. It's very interesting and I would say rather uplifting. The interest of the administration of Obninsk to our technology is good, of course. But as far as I know, Andre, you have made very interesting models of motor vehicles with a motor based on the combined winding Slavyanka, a sled and a quad runner. Tell us more about what is happening to these vehicles now, what the plans are and if it's possible to take a ride on them, if possible at all. Sure, one of the purposes of testing the vehicles under harsh conditions was determining how reliable the DA90S motor is. In order to do that, we have made a sled for hire. And the conditions there are very harsh, believe me. It's dirt and dust. It's really tough on the vehicles. Nevertheless, the motor performed exceptionally well. I don't know, I haven't seen such results before. I had an interview with a design engineer who had been rather skeptical about it before he installed the motor on the quad runner. But after he did it and took a ride, he said, my god, I will never ride a petrol quad runner again. For instance, a suburban electrical passenger train with a motor, a DA90S motor, in particular shows 30% battery consumption for 30 kilometers. This is purely amazing. I suppose all of these vehicles are now in Etnamir. It's an amusement park in Kaluga region. Come and visit it. You can have a look or take a ride. Foreign visitors are absolutely thrilled. England, France, Switzerland, America, everyone is screaming with delight. It's the first place they visit in order to take a ride on the Russian sled with Dunov's motor. If you're inviting us, we will definitely visit. I am looking forward to seeing you. Come and visit us. Great. Andre, you've mentioned 30% of the battery capacity, which means the drive range for this quad runner is about 100 kilometers. You can achieve that using the settings. There are some clever things. The motor has a controller and various settings. Using the settings, you can achieve the drive range of 100 kilometers. That's possible. 
A 60 ampere battery makes it quite possible. Great, then I hope that our next meeting will be in Adnamir, and we will try to check all of your vehicles there. Excellent, we will ask the design engineer to come and tell you about his experience of passing by wild dogs at 3 meter distance without even waking them. Thank you so much. All the best, thank you very much.